If you love living near the ocean, meeting visitors from around the world, and enjoying international eats on the regular, all with an urban feel, then Fort Lauderdale may be the place for you. Located along the stunning southeastern coast of Florida, Fort Lauderdale is a vibrant city renowned for its beautiful beaches, rich cultural scene, and a plethora of opportunities. So whether you're considering a relocation or simply exploring the perks of living in what is known as the Venice of America, Fort Lauderdale has so much to offer. And in this video, we'll dive into the benefits of living in Fort Lauderdale, including real estate, things to do, education, job market, transportation, shopping, dining, and I'm gonna keep it all within 10 minutes or less. Now before we start the clock, if this is your first time on the channel and you want to know everything you can about living in South Florida, make sure you go ahead and hit the subscribe button and tap that bell so you're notified whenever I drop a new video about what life is like here in South Florida. My name is Jonathan and my real estate team and I, we get calls, texts, social media messages and emails daily from people who are just like you that are looking to make a move to South Florida and we love it. So whether you're looking to make a move next week, next month or next year, feel free to give us a call, send us a text or find me on social media and we're happy to help you make your best move yet. Make sure to check out the description below. Okay, here we go. Alexa, start a 10 minute timer. 10 minutes, starting now. Fort Lauderdale, located in Southeast Florida, along the Atlantic Ocean, is the largest city in Broward County and the 10th largest city in Florida. In 2023, its population exceeds 179,000 people. Spanning over 36 miles, the city has a population density of 5,188 people per square mile. It's conveniently situated just 30 miles north of Miami and 30 minutes south of Boca Raton, making it an ideal location for those who want to be close to both Miami-Dade and Palm Beach County without fully committing to the Miami lifestyle. Fort Lauderdale boasts seven miles of beautiful beaches, offering a perfect destination for tourists and residents alike. It earned the nickname Venice of America due to its impressive 165 miles of inland waterways, 50,000 registered yachts, and 100 marinas, making it the yachting capital of the world. The city has a diverse population, blending Florida natives with snowbirds who come from states like New York, Massachusetts, Illinois, and California. Canadian snowbirds also find a welcoming community here seeking refuge from the cold winters up north with an average year-round temperature of 75 degrees Fahrenheit, 25 degrees Celsius, and over 3,000 hours of sunshine per year. Fort Lauderdale offers an enjoyable climate for residents and tourists. However, it's important to note that the city and South Florida in general can get extremely crowded between October and April, so be prepared for that. The greater Fort Lauderdale area can consists of 31 cities and towns, encompassing over 24 miles of beaches. Now, while the cost of living in Fort Lauderdale is 17% higher than the US average, it remains significantly lower compared to other well-connected coastal towns like Palm Beach, San Diego, and Key West. Fort Lauderdale has received an overall grade of A- from Niche.com, which evaluates cities based on various factors. Outdoor activities, it gets an A. Health and fitness, A-. Weather, A. Diversity, A+, nightlife, A, public schools, B, good for families, B, commute, B+, housing, C-, job, C+, cost of living, C, and crime and safety, C. Niche.com also ranks Fort Lauderdale highly, placing it as the fifth best city to retire in America, the 47th most diverse city, and the 50th healthiest city out of 228 cities evaluated. Now, let's delve into the real estate scene. The real estate market in Fort Lauderdale has been thriving over the past several years. Among the numerous cities across the nation, three prominent destinations stand out where people are seeking to relocate to Fort Lauderdale. And those cities are New York, Washington DC, and Boston. Most of them are seeking to escape the cold weather and high state taxes while keeping the city vibes. Fort Lauderdale, known for its association with the 1960 movie, Where the Boys Are, has evolved from a spring break destination to a year round urban community with luxury developments. This transformation began around 2016 when developers recognized the appeal of lower priced land on the same coastline as Miami and Palm Beach. Notable luxury condo residences such as the Four Seasons, Celine Oceanfront Residences, 
the Wave on Bayshore, Edition Residences, 160 Marina Bay, and the newest luxury condo downtown, 100 Las Olas, have recently emerged along the ocean and waterways. If you're interested in single family homes, Fort Lauderdale offers various fantastic neighborhoods suitable for families and those seeking luxury retreats. However, it's important to note that living in these neighborhoods comes at a higher cost. While I'll provide more details on each neighborhood separately, here are my top five favorites. Coral Ridge, an upscale neighborhood in eastern Fort Lauderdale offering a country club lifestyle with easy access to a renowned golf course and tennis facilities. It features a mix of home types, including contemporary waterfront homes, senior communities, and ocean view condos and townhomes. Number two, Cole Hammock. Established in 1916, it exudes Southern charm and rich history. Known for its meticulously restored historic homes with wraparound porches and unique architectural styles, including Spanish, modern contemporary, and Southern designs, the shaded streets and sidewalks are adorned with mature oak trees. Number three, Victoria Park. Located in East Fort Lauderdale, this neighborhood, established in the 1930s, provides an old Florida charm. Its small town yet hip ambiance has attracted a diverse mix of residents and Victoria Park is home to several lovingly restored historic residences. Number four, Rio Vista. Established in the early 1900s, this affluent neighborhood south of downtown Fort Lauderdale offers a luxurious lifestyle centered around yachting and boating. Waterfront homes with private docks suitable for large yachts and boats are plentiful in the area. Number five, Imperial Point. Tucked away in northeastern Fort Lauderdale, Imperial Point is a community with a strong sense of community. Built starting in the 1960s, it boasts active residents, beautiful parks, low crime rates, and highly rated schools. This neighborhood offers a range of options including renovated single family homes, waterfront properties, condos, townhomes, and senior communities. Now that we've identified our desired neighborhoods, it's time to explore fun things to do in Fort Lauderdale. Living in Fort Lauderdale offers a vibrant outdoor lifestyle with 165 miles of canals for boating and a variety of water-based activities. Take a water taxi to reach your favorite bars, enjoy drinks on cruise and tiki's, or go on a celebrity home sightseeing tour aboard Carrie B. For excellent waterfront dining, check out Blue Moon Fish Company and 15th Street Fisheries that's renowned for their seafood. Fort Lauderdale Beach is a sun-soaked destination with live music, beach yoga, sea turtle hatching, and surfing. Fort Lauderdale Beach is also home to some of the most unique beach bars. Sip on a tiki punch in a hurricane glass at Lulu's Bake Shack, or have a tropical cocktail and watch mermaids put on a show at Rec Bar. Families moving to Fort Lauderdale have endless entertainment options. Extreme Action Park offers adrenaline pumping rope courses and go-karts, while Dolphin World provides unforgettable aquatic experiences. Young at Heart is an interactive museum for kids, and the Museum of Discovery and Science offers engaging and interactive exhibits. For a true South Florida experience, board a high-speed airboat and tour the Everglades with airboat rides for Lauderdale. And if you enjoy golfing, practice your golf game at one of Fort Lauderdale's many golf courses. Experience a Tortuga Music Festival on the beach or visit the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show to see luxury yachts up close. Catch a show at the Brower Center for Performing Arts or learn about the city's history at the historic Stranahan House Museum, which is the oldest surviving structure in Broward County. Access to excellent education in Fort Lauderdale benefits everyone. If you're looking for one of the best private schools in Florida, look no further than Fort Lauderdale's Pinecrest School, which excels in both academics and athletics. The College Academy of Broward College is an outstanding public school option with a 99% graduation rate. GreatSchools.org rates Bayview Elementary School, Harbordale Elementary School, Florinata Elementary School, and Virginia Schumann Young Elementary School highly with an 8 out of 10 or better. Also, Fort Lauderdale offers numerous public, private, and community colleges. Fort Lauderdale offers abundant job opportunities with a low unemployment rate of 3%. Major companies like AutoNation, Hotwire Communications, Citrix Systems, Smart Water, CSI, and Spirit Airlines have their headquarters in and around the city. Tourism drives the economy with around 10 million annual visitors, supporting industries such as transportation, retail, accommodation, and food services. Healthcare professionals make up 10% of the workforce and other growing industries like technology, manufacturing, global logistics, and financial services receive support from the Greater Fort Lauderdale Alliance. Greater Fort Lauderdale Broward County has been ranked number two best business climate for a mid-sized metro and business facilities magazine 17th annual rankings report. This is second only to Arlington, Virginia, the site of Amazon's second headquarters. 
Although most residents own cars, Fort Lauderdale offers a variety of public transportation options. Broward County Transit, BCT, operates nearly 400 buses on 42 daily routes connecting Fort Lauderdale to Miami-Dade and Palm Beach counties. For faster travel between Miami, Fort Lauderdale, and West Palm Beach, you could try the Tri-Rail and Express Train, and another option is the privately owned Express Train called Brightline that travels from Miami to Orlando and offers a luxury experience. Fort Lauderdale's strategic location makes it a popular starting point for vacationers. Port Everglades, the official Fort Lauderdale cruise port, is the world's third busiest cruise port accommodating up to 3.8 million passengers annually. Residents can also access the Fort Lauderdale Hollywood International Airport for international flights and the Fort Lauderdale Executive Airport for domestic travel. Looking for the best restaurants in Fort Lauderdale? There are plenty of options here. Start your day with a delicious brunch at Foxy Brown where you can enjoy famous donut holes, banana bread, grilled cheese, or a barnyard frittata. Indulge in exceptional Italian cuisine at Louis Bossi or savor the charred octopus and fresh catches like grilled swordfish or yellow fin tuna at Boatyard. Rocco's Tacos and Tequila Bar offers a wide selection of tequila along with mouth-watering tableside guacamole and tacos de casa. And don't miss the delightful nitrogen ice cream flavors like cake batter, dulce de leche, at chill and nitrogen ice cream. Fort Lauderdale's brewing scene has something for beer enthusiasts. Visit Lauder Ale, a dog-friendly microbrewery, enjoy Oktoberfest events and a range of craft beers at Coffner Brewing, or have a relaxed evening at Tarpon River Brewing. Fort Lauderdale Nightlife offers various options for entertainment. Join the energetic party scene at America's Backyard, dance the night away at Club Euro in downtown Fort Lauderdale, frequented by locals and celebrities alike. For a more upscale experience, visit YOLO and Blue Martini where you can enjoy bottle service and live performances every night. There you have it. Everything that you need to know about Fort Lauderdale in 10 minutes. Alexa, turn off the timer. I'll make a longer, more detailed video in the future and I hope you found value in this one. And if you wanna learn more about other cities in just 10 minutes, be sure to subscribe and hit the like button if you found this video valuable. If you wanna explore other cities in 10 minutes, then make sure to go ahead and check out this video.